This week on Inside Story, the people whose lives were ruined by a British institution they trusted. The whole of our lives really are based on, on trust, and it has been totally abused. It took their money. I was asked for £200,000. And it kept on taking. You're totally ruined. And taking. Unable to pay my losses. The inside story of the names wiped out by Lloyds. Tomorrow, 10 o'clock, BBC One. Now a look at the weather prospects for tomorrow. Scotland will have a mainly dry day with some bright or sunny spells, but the Northern Isles will be more cloudy and breezy with a little rain at times. Northern Ireland and Northern England will have some sunny spells after patchy overnight fog clears during the morning. Wales and southern England will have a good deal of fog and low cloud during the morning, this slowly clearing to give most parts some warm if rather hazy sunshine. Temperatures will be similar to today's, reaching a warm 18 degrees where it's sunny longest, but only 12 degrees where the mist and fog lingers. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. We are about to demonstrate the escape procedures. In the event of a fire, smoke may obscure your vision. It is important you know the way to the emergency exits. You will find the emergency exits here, here, and here. A warning alarm will sound. Are you all right, Sarah? Well, it just occurred to me that I do this drill every day, but I don't have a planned escape route from my own home. Why don't you try and draw one for me? We should work out the best route to escape if there is a fire. Make sure that escape routes are clear and that exits are easy to open. And put in now. Right. When you're ready, we'll have a rehearsal. Plan your escape route now. Don't leave it until it's too late. That was a public information film. And it brings Wednesday night on BBC One to a close. If you don't have sleep on your mind for the moment, you'll find music on radios one and two. The World Service is being broadcast on Radio 4 Longwave. And on Radio 5 Live, there's late night conversation after hours. Thank you for your company here tonight. Till our next encounter, take care. And good night from me, Roseanne Macmillan, and all on BBC One. <laughs>